The Hive sur Pure Channel, c'est un vrai plaisir de recevoir ce groupe qui va jouer ce soir. C'était la tête d'affiche avec The Kills qui ont annulé, donc on est heureux qu'ils soient là. Et l'album qui va sortir, c'est Lex Hives, qui sortira le 4 juin. Hi, thank you very much for being on Pure Channel. I was just reminding that hopefully you're playing tonight because you're one of the headlines with The Kills and they cancel. So everyone oh, is going to yeah. So everyone oh, is going to run to your gig. Uh, oh, we will play. My first question is of course The relation in between the new one and the last one. The last one was a surprise in your discography, taking very much time going to new orientations. How is that one going back to garage straight or very experimental too? Well, I, if it's experimental, it's experimental in a different way. It's uh, more uh, traditional, I would say, less uh, less us going modern, less technology and more um, just playing in a room turning up amps and tuning up guitars and going for it but it still has uh, some different songs on it that are not that are not just uh, traditional hive stuff so yeah you were going to many other productions but keeping the the importance of the reef guitars yeah. and that very important groove, bass, drum, uh, bass and drums, of course, so you going back to that in a very rock and garage way? Mm -hmm. One. Well, yeah, I guess we kind of kept that a little bit. It's definitely more grooving than some of the other stuff we've done, but it's also, it's pretty straightforward rock and roll. It's, it's a very simple, simply recorded record and very, uh, it's pretty aggressive, I think. And, uh, But it has some stuff on it that, that might be surprising, I think. So it's also the very melodic and, you know, the chorus you can't get out of your head. Well, yeah, it's got hits on it. <laughs> yeah, you've got, yeah, you've got many hits. Yeah, this, I was mentioning Vedi Vici Vicious. Uh, it's amazing, the, the, there were four hits on that record. Uh, Die All Right, Men Offender, Hate To Say I Told You So, Supplied and Demand. Yeah. It's crazy. And then it went to a sort of best of your favorite uh, new band when yeah. you sign to another level but yeah you you back to those five or six it's record yeah so you're gonna well, have a lot of you try to do every time like we this one is a 12 hit record <laughs> <laughs> something completely new for the hive yeah, yeah. Every, song is in. every song is in yeah, I, mean, we, I think we always liked hits or what we thought were hits by you know our favorite bands we would always make mixed tapes or we'd make mix CDs or whatever where we would just you know pick the best songs from that's the way we've always sort of listened to music so I think we were always really interested in three minute hit songs but we weren't really we thought that it's cooler if, they, if it's a hit that's not based on like a melodic like a chorus or it's cooler if it's just sort of a groove like you know Wooly Bully or My Sharona or You Really Got Me or something where it's like a riff for a groove that makes it a hit and not like a uh, big sort of uh, melodic hard rock chorus. Well, yeah, on this one, We are less less on the last one, but I mean every time you, we only use old guitars and amps pretty much when we record records. It's very rare that we use anything new really. If it's something new we use, it might be like, well we use computers a little bit, some less on this record than on the last one. But really everything we record is like it's old drums and old old guitar amps and guitars pretty much. Maybe new cables. Yeah. Hey, new cables, yeah, that, that, yeah. This you can do it. Uh, tonight is an event because it's your first re uh, concert in France with that new record. Uh, so are we going to discover the full record, Lex Hive, tonight on stage? No, I think we'll play, we'll play a few songs, but uh, we, we will not play. We'll play more when the record's out. 
it's it's more fun for the you know for the crowd if they have a, had a chance to listen to the records. Yeah, they know the lyrics. Yeah, exactly. But uh, well, we'll play some new songs, maybe four, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Something like that. And then the suspense will be all till the 4th of June. Yeah, exactly. It's the release. Well, thank you very much. Uh, the, the last question is to know is if you've tried already many times on on stage the new songs if you've tried them all a little bit we played not all, of them, not right? all no we played maybe four or five songs on yeah. stage on the new song but the response uh, was yeah. it's been good yeah. it's been really, really good. good yeah we played a few uh, club shows in new york and paris london stockholm yeah. just to get get cracking it's and, been really uh, cool that people seem to learn them pretty quickly like they seem to know them by the end maybe it's YouTube I think it's YouTube but I'd like to think that it was because they learned them really quickly <laughs> but is it is it also I don't know how to say it but I love the way you write the songs you know that's like general um, themes say in very straightforward words yeah. and that's what also gives us the envy to sing it and scream it and be in the energy yeah. with you so was it this, yeah, the same envy of finding simple words for sometimes complicated fittings? But yeah, yeah, I think that's. I really liked it when when uh, music works that way, that you take something complicated and you just sort of boil it down into the smallest, the barest essentials. I think we always like really minimal music, like uh, from the Ramones to Kraftwerk, and you know. All, a very simple music because then you get to fill in stuff in your head it's like watching a a movie where they don't say a lot but there's a lot being said between the lines sort of i was looking because i noted somewhere craft work on one of the previous songs so it made me think about it anyway i'll write it on the website but yeah. um yeah thank you very much and for um hope yeah looking forward to hear all these songs yeah and uh yeah, I was very happy to talk to you. The simple words for complicated feelings. <laughs> uh, I hope I will hear them soon. Thank you very much to you too. And Thank I guess you very much. Nice. It's nice to talk to you. It was a pleasure.